Brooke, tell me a little bit about your uh, experience as an attorney and what you've been specializing in and how many years you've been doing it. Well, I graduated from Harvard Law School in 1996. In the past 18 years, I've practiced all different kinds of law. I've been a large firm corporate international and business attorney. I've also done immigration work in Miami, in Washington, D.C. I did mergers and acquisitions, asset purchases, stock purchases, taking companies public, and then unwinding them in, uh, in companies in distress. Ten years ago, I returned to Brevard County, hung up a shingle, and started practicing uh, various kinds of law. I've represented clients in criminal matters, family matters, circuit civil matters, real estate, business disputes, and uh, a little bit of everything. A few years ago, I decided to focus my attention on working with divorcing couples. And I'm a Florida Supreme Court certified family mediator, Florida Supreme Court certified circuit civil mediator, qualified arbitrator, and qualified parenting coordinator. I also volunteer as a guardian ad litem, working with at-risk youth who are in foster care. In addition, I have taught for several semesters as an adjunct law professor at Florida Institute of Technology. Well, what made you all of a sudden decide that you wanted to be a sitting judge? Well, it's not all of a sudden. I've uh, wanted to be a judge my entire life. It's a calling. You know, when people come to court, they are having the worst day of their life. They're there for a divorce, a foreclosure, a large lawsuit. We're dealing with abused and neglected children. We're dealing with the concerns of our elderly. It could be someone accused of a serious crime or a victim of a serious crime. Every single person that comes to court is really, they have a lot hanging in the balance. I want to make sure they're treated fairly and with respect, and that win or lose, they live with their dignity as well as justice. It's very important to me. This is my community. I was born and raised here, and I think the people of Brevard County deserve the best service to the people possible.